Bob 6.9, Savannah's number one for New Country. What's going on? I'm Jake Thompson, and I have a very special guest here in the studio. Uh, actually, just literally named right after you. It's Bob <laughs> Roblo from the Savannah Ghost Pirates. How you doing, man? I'm glad you guys had the foresight to name the station. Exactly. After me. I we knew, we knew that very one much. day yeah. the Ghost Pirates are going to be here, and we would need to have this name <laughs> set. I, I'm excited. Uh, but it's been a, been a busy couple days for you, man. It has. This has been awesome. You know. Listen, I can't say enough thank you to the people of Savannah, the people of uh, Southeast Georgia, because the the reception we've gotten has just been incredible. Uh, you know, we're already at 3,500 season tickets. We only wow. have 7,000 seats in the building. Um, you know, so and still five, six months out from a home opener, six months from a home opener. So it's, you know, I just tell people who want to see the Ghost Pirates, make sure you get in one of our season ticket plans, mini plans, whatever you want. Yeah. Because uh, the tickets are going to be scarce by the time we get to. I'm telling season. you, Savannah loves their sports, man. You get them for them, and they'll they'll come around. I, I cannot wait for this. Uh, of course, you got a brand new facility at In Market Arena, which is gorgeous. I think it's going to be an awesome time when the season rolls around. And yesterday, big event there. We unveiled our new head coach and our new NHL affiliate, and it was big. You, I'll let you be the one to break the <laughs> news. You. Go ahead. Thanks, yeah, because Mayor Johnson took that from me yesterday. So. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Um, but no, it, it, listen, Savannah is a fun town, okay? Has yeah. great vibes. There's another fun town as well in the United States, and that's Las Vegas. That's and, right. And the Golden Knights, <laughs> one of the premier organizations in the NHL in their short time in the NHL, has just taken over the NHL by storm. Uh, four out of five years in the playoffs. First year they went to the Stanley Cup Finals, mm -hmm. and we're hoping that in our first year they take yeah. us to the Kelly Cup Finals. There but you go. Las Vegas uh, was a team that when they called me, I was very excited that they wanted to come here. Yeah. And, um, you know, and then uh, we, we got it put together. We got the big announcement last night, uh, yesterday afternoon in front of 2,000 people yeah. at the end market. Um, you know, couldn't, have, couldn't ask for better partners. Um, we spent the night with them last night talking about setting up the team, and, and now we get into the nitty-gritty of actually putting the team on the ice, getting the players signed and stuff. And they've got so many ideas, and they have the, they're putting the entire hockey organization of the Golden Knights and the Silver Knights uh, – they're putting that into the Ghost Pirates, so That's awesome. so they're going to have a ton of resources, um, you know, to be able to talk to players, to be able to talk to player agents, and get guys signed here for Savannah. So you know, we're very excited. I got to tell you, I uh, I I didn't when I was thinking like I wonder who it's going to be, I wonder who it's going to be. Um, for some reason, I didn't even think Vegas, but there is not a more perfect marriage than Savannah and Vegas when it comes to this kind of a relationship, and I th I think it's going to be great. And the craziest part right now to me. As I remember, it was like it was a couple a couple months ago. It feels like where you were here to talk about some unnamed hockey team that's going to be coming to Savannah in a couple of years, and we're months away from the first game. How excited are you? How are you feeling with that? You know, I stood in the arena yesterday and uh, saw those people in there. Saw the all the uh, we had the the um, uh, dancers and the yeah, crowd yeah. and stuff like that. And I just said to my, I closed my eyes for a minute, you know, and and I said to myself. Imagine November 5th. Oh, man. This place will be rocking, you know, rocking. Mm -hmm. well, the full house will, you know, it'll be absolute. We're going to test how well they constructed that arena. That's right. You know? <laughs> <laughs> it's a beautiful arena. Uh, the Oakview Group uh, people have been awesome to work mm -hmm. with, um, you know. And uh, but we're going to push it to its limits. I can yeah. tell you that. Well, we've been talking about all the great shows that are coming to that uh, arena. But I'll tell you, there is nothing like a live hockey game. I was telling you before we cracked the mic that I love sports, but I'm not a, I, I, I'm not as well versed in hockey as I am in others. But yeah. there is nothing better than cracking a cold beer at a hockey game and just yelling at people. It's so much fun. <laughs> Listen, it's the best sport to watch in person. Hands down. If the only hockey you've ever watched is on TV, OK, you haven't seen hockey. It, yeah. It's the best sport to watch in person. Um, you know, football's great. Basketball's fine. Mm. Uh, you know, baseball. You can watch all them on TV. And most of the time, I prefer to do that because yeah. I don't want to sweat at the stadium right. or whatever. <laughs> right. But, you know, bring a sweater um, to, to the That's hockey right. games. The, the end market's going to get a little bit colder. That's right. Um, bring a sweater and just enjoy it. Uh, because even if you don't know all the intricacies of the game, uh, we're gonna we're gonna have programs that teach you and videos that teach you, but you don't even need to know that, man. You just see a bunch of guys out there with sticks <laughs> on ice skates, right. you know, uh, n not knocking into each other or fighting each other, you know, working hard. And yeah. you know, if you really want to start you know, your hockey primer, 
just watch the NHL playoffs on TV yeah. right now. I mean, the the and it, playoff hockey becomes even more elevated than regular season mm-hmm. hockey. And and those guys, they from the time they're born, they're chasing a cup. Yeah. So whether it's the Stanley Cup, the AHL is called the Cup or our Kelly Cup, they want a cup. They don't care what the financial right. incentives are. <laughs> they don't care how injured they have to play. They want a cup, and yeah. that's. Uh, that that keeps everybody so entertained. That grit is is what people love, and, and Savannah is shockingly uh, a little bit of a hockey town. We got that uh, that classic that comes here every every year, so we're excited for this. Now you said that uh, tickets are are selling well already, which is no shock. So if someone wants to get some season tickets, where do they need to go? Tell them how to get all that info. Yeah, ghostpirateshockey.com. You'll see a link for season tickets. Um, you know, we'll have someone call you once you fill out the information there. Uh, now with the arena built, you can actually even see your seats, um, there you, go. you know, uh, and then also the merchandise. I yes. mean, we sold a ton of merchandise uh, since we've announced the name and the logo of the team. Yeah. Uh, we've sold merchandise to people in Australia all over the, uh, the crazy, isn't it? The internet's amazing. <laughs> um, you know, so, uh, but yeah, and we've had some trouble keeping items in stock, but we're, we're well stocked up right now. Yeah. We've got a T-shirt that says, you know, what what happens in Savannah goes to Vegas. There uh, you, you know, go. So, I love yeah, that. We, it, it's great. Um, the next big announcement we'll have probably towards the end of June or beginning of July is our jerseys. Okay. Um, people yeah. are gonna love our jerseys. I showed I showed photos of the jerseys yesterday to the the people from Las Vegas, and they just they just thought it was the, awesome, the most awesome thing ever. I and can't they wait. have some pretty pretty hot oh, jerseys yeah. as well. So. Yeah. Well, you, you know, get a lot of fun with the Ghost Pirates and, uh, and not only with the name and what you can do with it, but at the stadium as well and at the arena, which is coming up here, like you said, November 5th, first game. Can't wait for it. Uh, you got to get those season tickets, though, because, man, that's uh, that stuff is flying. I know uh, my buddy Marshall, uh, who uh, yeah. has got his season tickets already. I've already told him I may be, uh, I may be his date a couple nights because I, I can't <laughs> wait. Uh, Savannah and Ghost. you know what? You don't have to take all 36 home games. I mean, right. We, <laughs> exactly. We have, yeah. we have picket gate plans, things like that, but. You, you really should um, come out and see this and, and get a ticket plan as early as possible yeah. uh, because, you know, you don't want to get shut out. That's, yeah, don't want to miss it. And, and, of course, it's going to be fun for the entire family. Bring the kids. There's going to be a lot of great stuff going on with the Savannah Ghost Pirates. Bobo Roblo, thank you so much for coming and hanging out with us, man. It's been, it's been an absolute pleasure, and I cannot wait for some Ghost Pirates hockey. Thanks, Jake. And never change the name of the station, okay? You got it. <laughs>